Hi guys, uh, this is my first video and I am absolutely inspired by everybody that has been doing their Stella and Dot. So, um, this is actually my most recent haul. It actually doesn't even have two or three of the things. I guess they're on back order, but I figured I'd show you guys what I have now and I think I completely outdid myself this time. It is ridiculous how much jewelry I have. Recently had a trunk show. I'm going to go through this real fast because I think uh, most people like to see stuff rather than hearing me talk. So here we go. Uh, these are those um, pink coral Seychelles earrings, I think is what they are. I had one of them in turquoise and blue lapis, but my hair is dark. So I figured these coral pink ones would look better um, with my dark hair. And plus also I have these uh, Serenity um, stone in small in the blue lapis so I figured you know pink blue looks pretty nice right um, I also got these I believe they're called the lily chandeliers um, love this mint color um, especially against the gold never used to think I'd like mint but um, I'm a believer um, here are the carabella earrings in rose gold I am a sucker for rose gold, so um, I've always wanted these, and they're on sale right now on Stella and Dot. Oh, this one um, truly amazed me. I did not think I would like them, um, and in fact, they look kind of meh in the catalog, but this, uh, these are the Arc Drop earrings in the purple, and as you can see, I think they are absolutely gorgeous, and I, I'm really happy that I got them, and it actually matches one of the necklaces that I got, which is the Pippa. In purple so I'll show you two in a, um, in a bit and this guy the Dakota earrings um, I haven't seen too many of these on YouTube absolutely gorgeous absolutely delicate um, I don't have the matching Dakota necklace but I do have the Avalon fringe which I will show you but I love these um, they are really light and um, the way that Stella and Dot packages uh, their these particular earrings especially they come in a little mini plastic bag so it doesn't get all tangled up so I really really like that um, that they take care of um, the way that these earrings came and then I didn't put these out on the earring stand because I thought they look so much better against the white uh, these are the Sanibel um, earrings and these awesome flakes on the top here love them I love these. I have the Sanibel pendant uh, necklace too, so I'll show that in a bit. Okay, let's go over here and see what we have. Oops. All right, I have here the, I believe they're called the Jeton. And these are the silver and the rose gold kind. Um, I think plenty of people have videoed this particular necklace. Um, I've seen this on someone, didn't think I would like them because I was like kind of mm, meh, you know, they look kind of whatever. But then I took a look again and I think, I, I think I'm sold. Well, I guess I'm sold because I got them. So, all right, oh, this necklace. This is the Avalon fringe necklace. Look how gorgeous that is. Let's see if you can, maybe if I put it on the floor, you can see a little bit better. The fringe is so beautiful, the delicate necklace itself, and I love this part here. And, and see, I think they kind of go together. What do you guys think? Yeah, that looks really nice. I am very happy that I got this guy, and I think I got this guy at half off because I hosted the trunk show. So that um, makes for a perfect purchase. Um... The Zoe Lariat, I think plenty of people have videoed this guy here. The regular Lariat um, that you can wear multiple different ways. I'm not going to spend too much time on this guy. Uh, here are the Pippa necklace. Or here is, I should say. The only reason why I say are is because I actually have the green one too. But um, maybe I'll do a collection video sometime takes too much effort to take all of my stuff out of the jewelry box and Miss Olivia I was a little hesitant um, when this guy first came I think it came out last year in the fall and I opted for some other coral red necklace so 
finally I decided to uh, to get her. All right. Here's the Sanibel and the Alexandria. So, this guy here, light color, dark color, light color, dark color. So, you can wear it long, and here's the S hook that people have been talking about. So, I guess you just take it out and then you can shorten the uh, necklace a little bit. I'm going to put this guy away. The Alexandria is probably going to be discontinued because um, it's currently on sale on, on the website, so I'm guessing that's on its way out. All right, um, so next I'm going to show you all of the bracelets. Um, some of them I have on my hands, so or my arms, my wrist. Uh, these are the ones that um, just kind of laying out here. Um, the Maisie, I think that's how you say it, um, in brown. And then I have... The Wonderlust Silver, sorry, Wonderlust uh, Mixed Metal Single. Sorry, my cat's talking in the background. The uh, Maya bracelet in Labdorite, Labradorite. I think that's how you say it. Sorry if I mispronounce. They're really cool. I love this. Alright, you can kind of tell. Um, oh, so the, usually, and I'm sure you've seen some of these boxes here, they come in here in, in these nicely packaged boxes, but the single um, Wonderlust wrap came in this cute little thing, which I've never seen before, but, you know, it's, it's really cute. And the Emerson bangle. So there's, um, so here's the, it's hinged. Uh, there's one in blue as well. But I, um, this one is on sale. I like this one. I have a lot of lapis blue. I figured I'd go a little bit different and stick to some silver stuff. And then um, I also got the Friendship Ties. I think this is the love and here's the red on the back. And these are the ones where you can um, close them tighter to your wrist if you have really tiny wrists. Or you know make them as large as you want them to be. Okay, and I have some on my hands, or my wrist. Here's the Zinnia, the Julep, and the Gilded Arrow. I don't know if you can kind of see, it's kind of twisted. Yeah, you can adjust the size. I love the Zinnia. I had the Jolie necklace, but it's not part of this haul. Like I said, maybe I'll do a collection sometime. I want the Julep in blue and green as well, but I figured I'd maybe stop myself before um, I'm in a lot of trouble. Um, I also got these stackable rings. I think they're called the Morley. Um, I'm not wearing my wedding band right now, so I just stuck them on there. They're actually a lot skinnier than I thought they were going to be, but they are absolutely gorgeous and delicate. I love them. All right, on the other arm, let's see if I can show you. Here is uh, the Eden. Sorry. All right, here's the Eden. And then the triple um, Wonderlust in turquoise. Love turquoise. And then here's the Maya bracelet in turquoise as well. I have the Maya pendant that I'm wearing right now, uh, but I'm not going to turn the camera around because you guys know. I mean, it's going to look just like that, but a necklace. And then I have the, oh God, what is this ring called? I can't remember what it's called, but it, I have both the turquoise, which I bought two years ago, and then I just caved in and got the Labradorite one because I got the uh, my uh, bracelet in that color. And then, yes, Miss Turquoise ring. Love, love turquoise. Looks absolutely gorgeous. And you know, I don't know if you guys have, um, for those of you that have the Maya turquoise um, pendant and the bracelet as well, um, the, the colors are kind of weird on my pendant. Um, there's a lot more splotchy blue blues instead of turquoise on my pendant. So I don't know if that's what they mean by, you know, each donor is... Uh, unique but I didn't expect it to be like that but either way I, I still like it so 
All right, so I think I think that's all. Oh, you know what? I do have one more thing, but I didn't unwrap it. Um, but I'll just talk about it. It's the Tech Wallet in Snakeskin or Python. I can't remember. Well, anyway, here's all my stuff. Let me do a quick pan around. It's kind of crazy. I can't believe I got all this stuff and some are free, some are not. Um, and here is the disaster zone. That is my closet right now with all of the things I just unwrapped and the boxes and it's, it's kind of crazy and ridiculous, but all right. I hope you guys enjoyed this and we'll maybe see you in a couple of months. I don't know. We'll see. Thanks. Bye.